an iconic Tampa Drive-In restaurant is being reborn. Yeah, how about this? A sign of things to come in Old Hyde Park Village, and it's got people's mouths watering already. It's a little bit of a tease. Ah, they gave away the sign. All right, new at 6, there's a whole lot of Christmas shopping and construction going on at Hyde Park Village in Tampa right now. The village getting a facelift of sorts with a lot of new stores and restaurants. And our own Lloyd Sowers, well, he got a sneak peek. Yes, he did. And there's something new and something old going on in there, isn't it, Lloyd? That's right, Kelly. Uh, you could call it, well, could you call it best of both worlds. What many people remember in Tampa with a new twist. Kind of like a 65 Mustang. For sign maker Paul Taylor, the iconic goody goody sign is more than plastic and paint and metal. It's a local legend. The hamburgers, the fries, the shakes, you name it. Good time, a lot of fun. Goody Goody was one of the first drive-in restaurants in the country with Model A Fords driving in. It opened in Tampa in 1925 with famous burgers, pies, and a secret sauce. For restaurateur Richard Gonsmart, it was a favorite part of growing up here. It's uh, fond memories of going there with my mom and my dad sitting in the car. Gonsmart bought the rights, the recipes, and the 1940s goody goody sign that stood on North Florida Avenue until they closed in 2005. And that sign is now getting a makeover at Thomas Sign Company in Clearwater. It needs some work. One side has a hole where the hamburger was. Are you going to have to make another hamburger to put here? We are going to make a hamburger that is going to duplicate uh, as authentically as possible the original hamburger. It's about 11 feet tall, 6 feet wide, and electrified. Check this out. The sign company still has to install the neon. That part of this sign hasn't lit up for many years. It will stand at the new Goody Goody under construction at Swan and Dakota in Hyde Park Village. They say they'll have many of the nostalgic recipes, but updated using all fresh ingredients under that refurbished sign that reminds so many. It's, it's just something that in people's hearts that uh, it makes them happy. It makes them hungry, too. They're expecting to open the new Goody Goody in Hyde Park Village this spring. It's from the owners of the Columbia and Eulalie, so a lot of expectations to live up to when that restaurant opens. It's going to be good, I can guarantee I you. I can with almost that, smell it from here, can family. you not? Yes, I, 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 I can't wait. My kids can't wait either. We'll take two.